Sometimes when I am teaching maths, I glance a student's face, and despite all my best efforts, he's just staring into space. I wish I had a foolproof plan to keep the lad on track. Gone are the good old days when one could rouse him with a smack. What every teacher needs is an intriguing little hook to keep their kids' heads out the clouds and glued into a book. And here's a whiff of something new, a tantalising rumour, a gift I'll pass from me to you. Some numbers have a sense of humour. All you need to do to make your lesson forecast sunny is pepper your oration with the number that's most funny. But which is the funniest number? Nobody can agree. Some people would say 42 and others 23. Which is the funniest number? Let's keep an open mind. Ignoring those who claim the question isn't well defined. I started counting one, two, three to try and raise a smile. But if the answer's transcendental, that could take a while. I made a search online, but now I can't imagine why. Just found a smart ass claim that it's the last digit of pi. Some think that eight is funny being zero in a belt. Some struggle to suppress a smile when they're a straight flush dealt. In bingo halls around the land, they laugh at legs eleven. And children often smirk at nine when it's eaten by seven. Oh, which is the funniest number? I simply can't decide where best to begin looking for the X that splits my side. Which is the funniest number? I'll get there in the end and cross my fingers that this hunt won't drive me round the bend. The number 154 is not significantly droll unless you're a computer nerd, geek, techie, dork or troll. For if you first convert the digits to base 32, you'll roll about in stitches when the output says 4Q. It would be just hilarious if all lecturers taught that epsilon's a tiny little fraction less than naught. And while we're on Greek letters, here's another little belter. I cannot get enough of Leopold Kronecker's delta. Oh, which is the funniest number? Which fills the soul with mirth? Which number makes you laugh the most between your death and birth? I think I have the answer. Any prodigy of mine is bound to laugh his head off when I mention 69.